Welcome in. What's up, Daniel? Good morning. Oh, so you uh, see a new logo up there in the corner. Yeah. Going to show off our league a little bit more up there. So uh, if you guys uh, don't know what I'm talking about. Go right there. Our uh, Twitch channel for our football league or head-to-head user league in W-O underscore L for the NWO league. We're in the middle of an off season right now. Um, I just switched schools from Mizzou to Oregon. Uh, Snossages took over in the middle of a season. So he was at Virginia Tech and he moved to Miami, Florida. And T. Clink left Virginia and he, now he's head coach at Tennessee. <clears throat> and we're still waiting on George to see if he's going to leave San Jose and go to a, a bigger school. Or if he's going to try and uh, slug it out with a uh, vastly inferior roster just because he had 33 seniors this last season. So he can't even replace all of them by getting 25 guys. So he's going to get a shit ton of um, walk-ons. So. <clears throat> anyway, let's get into this season. We, uh, we are number three. Um, let's review our schedule real quick and we'll get into this. Um, beat number one Notre Dame in a rematch of the Natty and uh, destroyed Iowa State. We were up 20 to nothing in the uh, dynamic, dynamic difficulty comeback code kicked in and they tried to make a run, but we crushed them in the fourth. And then uh, Michigan State, we didn't have too much trouble with. So. We're playing three games today, all home games. We have Rutgers, Maryland, and Illinois. And we have uh, several visits. <clears throat> Let's get in here and take a look at these points. I have uh, 700 points I have to allocate as well. So let's get this out of the way before I forget. And we advance and I don't spend all my points. So, Grimp, hey, welcome in, welcome in. So, um... Let me show you something because we found a couple of players off stream. Um, let's see. This guy, the 77 D end that nobody's interested in. Remember, we need three, no, two, two D ends, two D ends. So we found these two guys just hanging out. Nobody wanted. Um, Butler. 87 power move, 80 finesse, and 80 block shed. This guy, 82 power, 79 block shed. But he has 80 speed. Um, and then, um, was it this guy? I think it, yeah, it was this guy. We were third on his board. Um, I believe. And we, we, we just added him to the board. It's either him or it's another guy. Maybe it's... Let me look. It's a corner. I found a corner. No, it's this guy, Alex Woods. We just found him hanging out there. 77 overall with 93 speed and 89 zone, 82 man. So we went ahead and threw a, a scholarship at him. He didn't sign. Um, and we need one corner. So obviously that's the guy we're going to go for. So I'm just going to go ahead and give him 200 points right now. Um, mostly because I need to uh, spread out some of these points and uh, finish off some other guys. So we're going to give Vince Campbell another 100 points. Get him back up to 700. And they could be trap games. All right, so we do have a strong safety. These other two guys are backup options at outside linebacker. That's why I haven't offered them yet. We're just, they're just chilling out, hanging out just in case. Um, middle linebacker, we need one. Let's give him his other 50 points back. Um, outside linebacker, we need two. We're just going to give him his whole 300 because these guys were already first on his board and we're moving up. So we're, we're in good shape there. Again, D end, we need two. Um, we have this guy and this guy. 
we have all of these extra guys just just i mean we only need two right what's up mac dub um let me go to depth chart real quick and we can look at these uh defensive ends because i said we need two for these two seniors right but we can take three because we have a junior that'll be a senior next year so it's not the end of the world if we take three um what would that cost me three tackles i need three tackles on offensive line right so if i just go i need three because i have a senior and two juniors so if I leave this guy alone, or just replace him and him, we'll be in decent shape. Got a lot of youth. Um, we could spend that on another D end, and then come back and get another offensive lineman because we're we're basically going to recruit offensive linemen every single year. Um, but that would give us really young D ends to go forward with, to go with our young defensive line and our young linebackers. They can all play together. So by the time they're all seniors, they're all going to be in the nineties. Got stud corners, right? So, yeah, maybe we only go with two tackles because we're having trouble finding good tackles anyway. And we can get three of these guys because, like I said, we just added these two guys. No one's interested. In. We have him that we're number three. Uh, this guy we're number two, but we're having to fight LSU. And this guy we're number one. We're not even putting points on because we're ahead of everybody. And you can see tackle. We have these two guys that we're doing pretty well. But then we drop off dramatically. So, yeah, maybe maybe you will just go ahead and make that change. And I'll uh, do that now so I don't forget. We'll just go three defensive ends and two tackles. All right. Can't pass up studs like that. USN, welcome in. Mac Dub, hello, hello. All right, tight end, we need two. Number one on this guy. And he's uh, number two tight end in the nation. And then this guy is just a roster roster filler. <laughs> Wide receiver, we only needed two. We got three. Um, this 69 is going to get cut. Look at this guy. 93 speed, 93 route running. 94 speed, 89 route running, 78 catch. Need two halfbacks. Um, they're mostly just filling roster spots <laughs> at the moment. <coughs> Pardon me. We got two stud quarterbacks last season, including the one we're starting that has 90 speed and 86 throw power. And we have another guy with 89 speed, 86 throw power being redshirted. This guy would just slot in as a depth guy because I like to carry four so he could get redshirted next year. And then uh, these athletes, this guy, 93 speed, he's actually a running back. If you look, he's got 83 elusive, 72 carry, 72 break, 83 stiff. This guy's a running back. And then this guy could play running back as well. He could also play safety. I think we're trying to get him to play free safety. Imagine a 96 speed free safety. So that's where we stand on the uh, points and... Uh, our recruits at the moment three games in We're sitting at number four so let me save this real quick hope you guys are uh, having a good day so far we uh we got we got three appliances delivered yesterday and none of them are installed um the microwave wasn't going to get installed anyway we uh we have to take the other one off the wall. It mounts under the cabinet over the stove. Um, and I can't do that by myself right now, especially with my uh, arm the way it is. Um, and the stove wasn't going to get installed because the way we have the shut off, it wasn't directly behind the stove and they weren't going to do it. So I'm like, fine, just leave it in the kitchen and my son and I will do it tomorrow. But they were supposed to install the dishwasher and they didn't. And uh, so we have a plumber coming today to finish that hookup. So... I have to dip out for a second in the middle. You know what's going on. <clears throat> Here, you can see what Iowa was looking like. These five years, they were being coached by James Franklin. And he got fired. And then we took over and we won the Natty in the first year unexpectedly. So we're looking to add four more in a row. 
If we get five here at Iowa, I will 95% leave. We'll be out of here. I fulfilled my promise to Jimmy. We'll get in here. We'll win more natties. And we'll go somewhere else. Probably Oregon if the job's open. But we'll see. Macon, welcome in. Welcome in. Yeah, Daniel, we, we do have uh, a chance for some trap games in here. Let's go do... Uh, Let's go look at our uh, our schedule in here as opposed to my pretty graphic because this will show what the other team's records are. All right, so you can see Notre Dame, even though we beat them, they're, they're back up to number four. Yeah, this Rutgers game is going to be hard. Maryland game shouldn't be a cakewalk. Illinois, we should destroy. Sorry, Specta. <laughs> and then our next stream... We have uh, Northwestern, Wisconsin, and Minnesota. That's not going to be an easy stream. Uh, the last regular season stream will be these three guys. You can see Mississippi State SEC team on there. That's going to be a rough one. And then the uh, last stream of this season will be hopefully Big Ten Championship, Bowl Game slash BCS, and then the off season. So we're going to spread this out and try not to do six-hour streams. So... That's where we sit. Oh, I know you guys saw the uh, news about John Madden yesterday. I, I have a tweet to read to you guys later. Some people should just keep their opinions to themselves, especially on social media where it's uh, it's forever because of the Wayback Machine. And, and some people have a, a doctor um, label attached to them, even though they're not a real doctor. They're just a... Uh, I used to have a master's degree, and uh, I'm, I'm shocked that this guy was smart enough to get a master's. So, anyway, as you can see, their offense is slightly better than us, but our defense is better. Last year, we rocked an 83 defense, so this is a huge improvement, um, and it's it's been uh, much better for us this year. Haven't had quite as much uh, cheesy garbage going on. We're going to leave them in all white. Except I'm going to make, see if they have red shoes. Yeah, they have red shoes. All right. Um, and we're going to go all black. <laughs> so. <clears throat> got into it with some uh, low IQ idiot on Reddit last day and got suspended for 30 days <laughs> on the Madden Reddit. Yeah, so I just unjoined. Fuck Madden. I know some of you guys play Madden, and I'm glad that you enjoy the game. Um, I hate that game, and uh, some people just can't can't uh, can't take other people not agreeing with them. So, um, yeah, I was I was rather direct and rude, but he jumped onto my comment and said, "Fuck you." I wasn't respond. I wasn't directing my comment at anybody in particular. So I replied in kind, and we went back and forth. And uh, I was rather graphic in my description of what he should do with his mother, and the mods didn't appreciate it. So, all right. So we do have visits. As I was saying before, I don't know how many defensive visits we have. Um, so we do have to rush for 100, pass for 250. I've told you guys many times that should be your minimum stat goal every week so that when you get your visit weeks, um, that's an easy goal, not a problem. The third one, the pass to the tight end for 100 is a pain in the ass, um, and you know how I take care of that. We feed the tight end the entire first half until we get it, and then we finish the game playing it normal. So if you see me... Uh, abusing the out route to the tight end or whatever just know i i want to get this met in the first half so we don't have to deal with it yeah there was no big loss getting kicked off madden reddit there's too many mutt people in there anyway no if i got kicked off ncaa that would be a shame that was my that's my first suspension on reddit it was well deserved and well earned and i don't really care All right.
And you can see we got a new logo in the upper right hand corner there. Advertising the NWO here. I'll do a discord too. If you guys want to, uh, check out the discord and oh guys something i i i did new let me pause this for a second i don't usually fill out the about me page because it's just just a pain in the ass and i don't feel like anybody reads it but i did update my about <coughs> my about page on twitch and added links to all the other guys that are in the nwo league but I also added a section down in that section, you'll see logos for all the teams that I've coached at on stream. And if you click the logo, it will take you to the playlist on YouTube so you can watch the videos for that specific team. Let me get that for you. I'll just throw it in chat. Yeah, Lou is Kamish. Let me go to here actually if you just scroll down on the page right now on my stream you'll see so all of those so the ulm was sim only just to do recruiting to show people how i recruit northern colorado was mostly sim um and that I, I played on some of that when I was recovering from my broken wrist. Jose Cuervo, that was a coaching one I did with the broken wrist. Um, Mizzou was my first one. And then Texas Tech, UCF, Ohio State, Texas A&M, Iowa, all of those streams. Um, all those streams are with this head coach. So anyway, that way, if you want to go watch any of the old stuff, you have a really quick way to go find it. And it'll automatically load the entire playlist. That's where I uh, archive all the stuff because I used to ah get sucked into my own gather. They used to uh, remove all of my my uh, vods off of here for some reason. They they remove them all much slower, so that's where I put them so I can go back and find something. Um, like I went back and looked at my Texas Tech first season to see what that recruiting class looked like. And, uh, um, I wanted to see what, uh, Mahomes' uh, ratings were compared to this quarterback. <clears throat> yep. Oh, let me get these fixed. Yeah, no, some people don't uh, keep their VODs. Um, I keep it specifically for um, recruiting. So if somebody asks me about recruiting, I tell them, go watch this playlist. You go watch that playlist. And uh, that way they can passively watch it whenever they want to. Um, and I highly recommend if you watch any of my VODs on YouTube to put it on 2x speed. Um I talk slow enough that 2x won't sound chipmunky and uh, it'll save you the time because I have some six and seven hour streams in there, man. Fuck, that was a pick. Ooh, I'm lucky. Should have just thrown that away. Also, if you weren't in here before, we went back to the uh, we went back to the uh, JKit sliders I used on Texas Tech. I I was getting too toxic with my own stream on these uh, 50, the 50 um, user and 60 CPU. So this is JKits. The only difference is uh, QB accuracy for both is 10. <clears throat> yeah, I, my wife gets upset with me because I don't, uh, if I can't do it perfect, I don't do it at all. So she'd rather me try it and fail than just say, fuck it, I ain't doing it. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, no, that's not how I work. I either do it or I don't. All right. X. Boom. It's not the tight end, but that's a first down. <clears throat> yeah, that's why they won't let me quit as commissioner from my fantasy league, be fantasy football league I've been doing for 20 years because no one else would do it. <laughs> 
We do an auction and not a draft. Look at this 90 speed run at quarterback. Um, and I run the auction and uh, bid on my own players at the same time. So, all right, let's hit up this tight end and get him going because uh, I got to get that goal met. I've added probably eight tight end passes alone in the last two weeks. Oh, oh there's the uh, 10 QB accuracy in motion. Cannot throw on the run with this guy till he gets warmed up. So let's go with... Uh, let's go with this one. Abrams, R1. There we go. First down. 11 yards. With these sliders, I have to warm up my running back and my quarterback because um, they uh, they do not form at top level right away. I like the running backs have to take about uh, five or six carries before they actually have their acceleration. And the quarterbacks take about five completions before they, uh, they don't air mail some throws. So it's a challenge. After that, it's pretty easy. So he has a little bit of a wiggle here. He still runs really well, but he doesn't uh, doesn't have the initial burst. So goodness, let's go. Get away from me! All right, I want to know how fast fifty eight is because my running back has ninety something speed. Look, my running back has ninety five speed. And that, that middle linebacker beat me to the spot. It is 87 speed. Oh, I have eight points higher in speed, and he beat me to the spot. <coughs> All right, third and six. See if we can get this tight end pass for a touchdown. Should be over there by the A. Be past the A towards the post, the uh, flag over there. There it is. Thank you. That particular play, I have three receivers. It's geared towards that tight end, but I also have the other tight end next to him on a slant in case they cover that. And then the uh, wide receiver far to the left. Um, if they back way off and they're 10 yards off, I'll just wait till he gets to the uh, top of his route before he makes his in cut and just throw the ball. And that's an easy first down. BYU lost. Good. So, uh, it's always good to uh, study your plays and know your routes and know where you can go because if the main guy gets covered right away, uh, you won't have to just bail and run out of the pocket with your quarterback. You can find somebody else. Plus, if you see the guy playing off on that outside wide receiver, my focus shifts to him immediately. I just got to make sure the uh, middle linebacker or the safety doesn't... Uh, Let's start with the two men under and see how they play this. Um, if that safety or linebacker drops back into coverage in zone, then that kind of takes that pass away. Come on. Somebody get him. I can tell you right now, I don't play defense nearly as well as somebody like Revamp. Revamp's a stud on defense. He loves playing defense. I would, uh, I would sim defense if it would uh, turn some people off. <laughs> Fucking hate defense. I love it in real life. I hate playing it in this game. What I need to do is attack more. I love the blitz. I don't do it enough, even in the user leagues. Get my play call sheet up here. Come on. I wish our running backs could punch the DB in the face and uh, break a tackle like that. Yeah, that was a straight left, and he decleated the safety with a with a punch. That wasn't a stiff arm; that was a punch. All right, we're going here. Fuck this. 
We're going to take away their run. Ah! Come on. Somebody tackle him. I'm whiffing. That's why I had that corner blitz off the edge to take care of that play, and he hit the he hit the quarterback like he was supposed to, but nobody else... Look at this. All these guys are, are tied up, and not one of them sheds a block. Not what I wanted to do. Hold on a sec. Called the wrong play, so I had to audible out of that. Yeah, that three four under will um, that three four under will take care of the uh, the read option and the spread and the regular option. Um, I just uh, can't get anybody to get off a block. Rocky Top, welcome in, man. Be doing better if my guys would actually tackle on first contact, but otherwise, doing great, man. Welcome in, welcome in. We have uh, Rutgers. Maryland and Illinois this morning. And run the option. Oh, how did he miss him? He ran right by him. He's supposed to take the quarterback. How? Let's look at this play. How did he miss him? He is specifically told to hit the quarterback. And he, and he just flat out whiffed. That wasn't me. That wasn't a user whiff. That should have been a pitch. <laughs> they are all home games today. And then uh, next stream, which will be uh, maybe tomorrow afternoon, I have rehab at 1030. So after lunch, we'll uh, play three more. And then... Uh, Friday will take off. I'm not going to do uh, New Year's Eve or New Year's Day. Um, probably come back on Sunday, which would give us uh, some time early next week to uh, finish this season off. Been mixing in some night streams in here. Pretty soon I'm going to be doing uh, volleyball tournaments and shit on the weekend, and that's going to affect... Um, my weekend streams because I'll be too damn tired from reffing all day and once we get into April that'll affect my uh, middle of the week streams too all right there's another one how many yards does he have remember this guy all right 37 so he needs 63 more let's try this play like I said I got tight end plays out the wazoo this is Iowa right X over the middle Oh, he dropped it. That's a shame. All right, let's get back into the uh, running mode so we can get this uh, running back all the way heated up. <clears throat> Look how slow he is. That's a 90... Was that 95 speed? See how slow he was off the rip? A couple more runs and he'll be good to go. do this one all right we got x and o doing dueling in routes one short one see one five one fifteen and then we got square down the middle on the post <coughs> here let me show you this play if i can find it the middle one, RNS, which stands for run and shoot. The switch dig. None of these receivers can get pressed. Watch how their oh, their first move is to the side, every one of them. That means they cannot get pressed. We're looking circle square. Circle. Oh, 
threw it behind him. And that circle route will always run to the first down marker. But if they uh, play uh, cover one, then that post route is going to be wide open. Look how slow he is. Because I have my running back ability down at like 30. Um, my run blocking's at 5. Doesn't seem to be a big deal with the run blocking. But, uh... Alright, all those guys on the left there are taking away Square's route. So we're going to go X or R1. X is open right away. Boom. That's a tight end route. <laughs> if they covered that X route, we would have just hit R1. And took the easy slant over the middle for the first down. All right, let's get this quarterback involved. This guy doesn't have the warm-up issue that the halfback does. No, push. There we go. This quarterback has had um, 100 yards rushing every game so far this year. So I'm, I'm, I'm ravaging like 200 yards on the ground a game. Because both the quarterback and the running back are getting 100 yards a game. And my QB is just shy of 300 yards. Eagles, thank you for the uh, host, man. Appreciate that. Look at this guy. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Let's see if we can get this playoff. Don't know if we're going to get it off with the uh, motion man here or not. I should have pitched that. <clears throat> Not a lot of motion plays in the Oregon book. I was messing around the other night um, on Discord with the guys from uh, NWO playing different playbooks. And the, uh, the Ohio State playbook for quarterbacks. Oh my God. I ran for over 200 yards with my quarterback. Had over 300 yards rushing total in the game. But they have garbage when it comes to pass plays. Here we go. Running back's getting warmed up now. <clears throat> so that's how I spend a lot of my non-stream time is... Uh, I have a test dynasty. It's even called test on the save. And uh, I just play different playbooks and uh, see what works, see what formation it's in. <clears throat> Come on. He drug three. It took three guys to tackle him. He should have been tackled in the backfield for a loss. And their RB ability is like forty. It's not even. It's not even default. So there's no way he should be. Uh, whatever. I'll stop complaining. Go down. Come on. This is me normal. I, I, I give up a ton on defense, and I, I don't even really care anymore. My attitude is I'll just outscore you. You might score me, but you're not going to stop me on offense. So...
should not have had to have that D tackle come in and help with that. All right, let's bring the heat. I'm going to limit how much time they have in the pocket here and make him throw quick. There we go. There we go. First stop on defense. Man, if you sit back in zone all day long, you're going to get picked apart, especially in this game. All right, I always do the punt return safe man because I've had, um, I think we're up to 16 fake punts against me now by the CPU. <laughs> and they actually had a, uh, Iowa State ran a fake field goal against me and scored a touchdown. That's why we put up 61 on them. Take a shot. Let's see what we can do. This might be a scramble. Watch this, right? This linebacker by Weddle, he might be blitzing. Oh. I'll take that all day. Yeah, Daniel, and it's all from the updates that uh, the revamp team did to the AI because I never had one fake punt run against me with the base game. Where was that throw? I can make that long dot, but I can't hit a five-yard um, slant. It's ridiculous. I never slide either, so I'll run into uh, a group of guys like that to keep them from hitting me from the side and, and causing a fumble, so... O looks good. Still looking R1. Fuck. I saw him at the last second. As soon as I was hitting the button, I saw him flash over. God damn it. I tried to uh, switch off and get off a block and sack him, and it would not let me. Come on, go down. Should have been a three yard gain. Nice. Gotta love that. I, uh, one of my uh, non streaming dynasties, I had a uh, head coach leave and go to Duke, and I had recruited a stud quarterback and athlete to play quarterback, and, uh, when I left and went to Duke, he transferred and went with me. So he had to sit out one year, which he was going to anyway. And uh, we won we won the Natty the first year he got to play. I always love getting a good quarterback at a new school like that. <coughs> Here's a draw play. Draw. See if we can hold these assholes to a field goal. That brings up second and nine. Let's bring some heat from the linebackers. Gotcha. Go down. There we go. 
All right, two stops in a row. Hold them to a field goal. We got to get our offense going. Our offense is still a little uh, shitty right now. I've been getting a lot more false starts when I change my uh, here. I change my uh, penalty sliders. This will affect gameplay as well. Which one is it? It's this one. So offside and false start holding that'll all affect offense and defensive line play. This offense and defensive pass interference will affect how they break on the ball, both as a wide receiver and a DB. Potential grounding affects the quarterback throwing the ball away. Um, I think roughing the roughing the passer um, affects them as well. Might affect the defense and how they attack. I got all that out of Jay Kit on uh, Operation Sports, and he uh, talks about why he puts everything on what he does. So. All right, kicker's not, he's kind of a half baby leg. He's not going to be making any 50-yard field goals, but he can make the, uh, the short ones pretty pretty easy. All right, two and a half minutes is like four times as much time as what we need to score. So let's get down there and score, eat some clock so that they don't get the ball. Or we can run a kickback. All right, 227. I might go quick here to try and get... Um, two possessions, stop them, and uh, try and get the ball back one more time before half. We'll see. I'm looking tight end right up the gut on this one. Or we'll take the easy slant. Thank you. And we'll run no huddle. <sighs> Any of you guys live up in the uh, Wisconsin area? My uh, daughter took off with her uh, boyfriend, his uh, family, they were supposed to go to Greece and they for uh, Christmas, and they canceled that. So uh, he traded Greece for uh, skiing in Wisconsin. So she's up there skiing for the first time. She sent me a video of herself. So I was really happy with that. Since I used to live in Colorado and ski, I never got a chance to take, take the kids skiing when they were young. All right, R1 and square. Tight end is X, though. No, no, we can just sack There's nothing on that play. Okay, see if we can hit this tight end for the first down here. Get out of here. Or more. Maybe more. I'll take that. Not going to show how many yards he has, but he's got to be over... Uh, over 50 now. Pretty close to 50, a little over. Not who I intended to throw to, but that was a good safety valve there, so we'll take that. <clears throat> Positive yards. We're not going to get doubled up on the uh, possessions here, so we're just going to try and eat this clock down and score before half and... Uh, not give them the ball back. Now watch my quarterback I'll scramble for a touchdown here, and it won't matter. He is so fast. We're going to have uh, my running back and the quarterback both run for a 1,000 yards this year. Jay Fletcher, hey, welcome in, welcome in. Ohio State's ranked number one, and they've got uh, half their team came from those uh, two classes that we recruited for them before we went to Texas A&M and then here. So I have to go through them again. Remember, we had to go to overtime in the Big Ten Championship game last year to beat those guys. Let's run cover four. Really hoping to not have back-to-back uh, -back multiple overtime games like we did to finish last season. Um, 
taking three double shots within an hour and a half time was uh, not fun. <laughs> Second and 10. Yeah, we'll make it first and 20 because it ate some clock off. Plus, now they need 20 yards. They're going to throw it deep anyway, so let's at least uh, make it harder for them. We'll just stay with cover four. So I have an idea for a, uh, a new stream. Actually, I have two. Two ideas. One of them is an NCAA stream. So at some point... I will do it. So what I was going to do on the NCAA stream, let me show you what the other one is. On the NCAA, I've realigned all of the conferences by geography, and every conference has at least 12 teams. Um, like the Big 12 is all the Texas teams. Um, so, but I'm not going to play the games. What I would do in that one is take over as a head coach and just recruit and fast sim the games not even watch the game just like advance the week advance the week advance kind of like param crow does and then if you get to a bowl game we'll play the bowl game um but we would just pick a school i'll let you guys pick the school and we'll just recruit and i'll spend the entire time recruiting basically week in week out get through the seasons and that way anybody that wants to see recruiting we can do that and i can archive that whole thing as just a basically a recruiting focused um, stream the other one is I got this game it's got over 240 uh, retired greats like uh, Barry Sanders John Elway Montana Dick Butkus Dan Marino Jerry Rice Walter Payton and uh You can make custom teams, and uh, I was thinking about getting the guys from NWO. I have to play it yet and see what I can and can't do. Sack, there we go. I'm calling timeout. Um, and let them put teams together. Maybe we, depending on what the game allows, do a draft in Discord with those guys. And uh, so 49er George would have, uh, he would have Marino and, uh, Marino. he'd have Montana and Rice together again. <clears throat> JT could have John Elway. Um, and we would just sim the games. The fast sim where we watch the sim. Come on. Um, and just broadcast the results of those games. And uh, nobody plays head to head. Just an idea. Um, but the, uh, the recruiting one, everybody loves... Um, Seeing how recruiting works and... Ooh, almost blocked that. And uh, that would be a focus for that entire stream. Oop. Let's get down midfield here. <coughs> All right. This, is, this route here is mostly for the wheel route, but X is my tight end, and I still need those tight end yards, so I'll gladly take that right away if I can. Let's throw it over the top to circle. There we go. I'll take that. 54-yard floating dot. Let him run to it. First and goal at the four. How much time we got? 14 seconds and a timeout. All right, let's try and run this in first. And uh, if we don't get it, we'll call timeout and try and throw it in. There we go. Big hole. The cool thing with that uh, all-pro football game, Rocky Top, is you can customize the uniforms completely, whatever colors you want. And I have a program, a separate program that I bought that will allow you to play uh, like a franchise and, and save year-to-year -year stats and everything because the game only is a uh, one-season type thing. And uh, that, uh, that program will let you uh, take the save file to your uh, computer and... Uh, store year to year stats so it's uh like one of the best game plays of all the uh, football games from back in there this is from 2008 so yeah 
game was not cheap. It was like 50 something dollars and the extra program was like 25. But my dad as cool as he is sends me a hundred bucks every year for Christmas. So I just paid $75 for that program in the game. So he's, he's funding it. All right. 28 to 10 at the half here. Good start. Get another stop here. Yeah, yeah, it was 50 bucks. I was uh, not happy with that. <laughs> but yeah, it is what it is, right? Oh, shit. Just get penetration and whiff on the tackle. Gotta love it. It's better than NCAA. NCAA is like 150 175 $200, whatever. Oh man. That brings up second and five. We're gonna bring some heat here. Look at that, he's got 143 yards rushing. They're spreading out and gonna run the ball. <coughs> wow. Yeah, that's a ripoff. I wouldn't pay five hundred dollars for the game. Especially with the new game coming out relatively soon like a year and a half um and they'll be worthless at that point i'm still not gonna buy that game right away come on especially if uh, i have to buy a ps5 for the new one i'm not i'm not dropping 500 dollars for a uh for a game system just to play one game i did it before i'm not doing it again they if they have the uh new college game on the uh, PS4, then I'll definitely buy it. But if I have to buy a PS5, then somebody else can figure out the recruiting. <laughs> Sad part is, if they make it for the PC, um, I would buy it, but I can't stream off my PC and play the game at the same time. So that would kind of negate that. Yeah, Rocky Top, I did that with MLB The Show. I upgraded from the PS2 to the PS3 to the PS4. And I'm just not... Ugh. Tackle him! Why are my guys running around him? Um, I don't know if it's coming out on the PS4. Actually, it's not in here. That's not where I need to go. I need to go, I need to go here. I normally don't play aggressive on uh, zone. But it's causing me, it'll take away those short passes, but it's also causing me to miss the tackles on the runs. I don't know if it's coming out on PS4. Almost guarantee it'll be a PS5 game, but um, it's supposed to come out in 2023. So, if it plays anything like the new Maddens, I will not enjoy it. The gameplay in the new Maddens suck. It just sucks. It's just... It's too sticky. You can't run with a shit. <clears throat> There's no subtle left-right change of direction like this game. It's just hard left. Hard right. And your guys go, Hey, he's hurt. Good. Get the fuck off the field. It's either going to be a sack or a touchdown. There's like nothing in between. We're either going to get to this quarterback or he's going to hit somebody wide open. Oh, he's going to run it in. <coughs> All right. Big stop here. Ah, couldn't, couldn't get him. Tried to uh, grab him at the last minute there, and he just shut it off. <coughs> it's kind of a pain in the ass. Right here. I thought I could get him, but obviously not. 
Damn. <clears throat> I have uh, chronic drainage from my sinuses. Like, it does it all the time, even if I'm not sick. So, that's why I have to cough so much. I'm just trying to clear my throat. It's really fucking annoying. All right, Henderson, let's go. Had it since I was a little kid, so it's nothing new. It's not age-related. <laughs> Yeah, that was dumb. I kind of ran right into that tackle. All right. Vincey see Bowen calls this the Vaughn special. Yeah, I don't know what uh, my wide receiver was doing being five yards behind me and like straight behind me he should be running up the field so i could pitch that ball because that was a that was an easy play to pitch the ball and he uh totally removed that from the equation I didn't throw, run him over. There we go. How many yards does he have? 100. Hey, all right. We met that goal for the recruiting, so now we can just play the game. <clears throat> Only need to complete one more uh, decent pass here, and that'll get us our 250. You're going to see me be a little more run-focused here. I'm going to get both these guys over 100, and then uh, we'll make sure we get over 300 yards passing. Alright, this tight end picks off this defensive end. This is going to be a good run. Let's get the first down and get down. Alright, we got our 100 yards, so I just need one more pass and we'll be at 250 and we'll meet all of our recruiting goals for the week on offense. Circle. All right, everything is met. Let's go see what coach wants us to run. We've we've done everything we needed to do. Let's run this read option. Taking care of our passing yards, our rushing yards, and our tight end yards. Down. Yeah. All right, where's he at rushing wise? He's at 60, the other guy's over 50. All right. Get up there, get up there. All right. I think this guy's a senior too, so the new running backs coming in will get more playing time next year. <coughs> All right, right off the fullback and the uh, tight end blocking there. R1 and X are going to be the lead blockers. Get in there, get in there. Ah. Thought I had that hole, he missed it. No push. Wow. Get up. No that makes it third and goal. All right.
World record holder on one yard touchdown runs. <clears throat> Not even close. <coughs> that was a eight half the quarter and took eleven plays. All right. Need to uh, speed it up a little bit. Make sure I get both these guys there. Hundred yards rushing. We're gonna run. The next drive is gonna be a lot of quarterback runs. Um, so I can end the game just pounding the uh, halfback because he's a little bit stronger. I don't want to get my quarterback injured. <coughs> like, what the fuck was that about? Ackle, god damn. Not one single person could shed a block. I was supposed to go up the middle. I guess he audibled to an outside run. But, you know, CPU sheds block as soon as you hit the right trigger. Never happens for us. I don't know if you're wondering about the uh, sweatshirt. When Elway played for the Broncos, I used to call him Biff and the Boys because he was a, a Stanford preppy, so I called him Biff. Biff Elwood. <coughs> All right, boys. Play some tight defense for a change. Yep. Oh, fucking missed. I had the sack. Had the sack. I had three guys there, and he gets that little jump pass off. Sit down. There we go. That's the end of the quarter. They're not going to get another playoff. All right, fourth quarter, boys. Fourth quarter. Oh, yeah! I have any mods in here? Nope. We have mods. Shout out. Shout out the guys. I can shout out Daniel though. I call him Young Daniel. Dude has a great stream all the time. He's always in a good mood too. Something I can't do. <laughs> Look, they have 55 yards passing. Of course. My spy guy gets picked off and he uh, breaks the tackle. It's fourth and five. You know they got to go for it. <sighs> got to watch the run because we can't stop the run. There we go. They have 55 yards passing. It's my daughter. I'll check it in a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They it doesn't matter what their overall is. They always they always break tackles. It annoys the shit out of me. Because my guy never does what theirs does, right? Do you see the last stream when an Iowa State dude picked the ball off and I literally hit him six or seven times and uh, he would not go down and he ran all the way back for a touchdown? Like he's running through the mass of the offense and defensive line and no one can touch him. Yeah.
All right, break some ankles here. Nope. I know how we can get some uh, rush yards for the quarterback. Give me a second here. This is a designed run out of four verts. And of course, he has no uh, no agility. The fuck he was... I did the uh, juke cut and he just fell down. Alright. Fine. Well, he's got his 100 yards receiving. <coughs> so he needs 13 more yards to get his 300. Let's try and get this uh, running back. Where is he at? Love how he can chase me down from behind and I'm... All right, he needs 17 more yards. What do we need on the quarterback? Coming to you, coming to you. Oh, nope, it's not going to tell me because he scored a touchdown. Let's find out. That was the easiest walk-in QB read option I've had in a while. All right. So he's at 287, 83, and 70. So... 30 and 17, so we'll we'll take care of that next drive. Throw one pass, get our uh, 300 yards. We don't have it already, and we'll just run with those guys the rest of the way. Might have to revisit these sliders and bump their defense up a little bit. Definitely not bumping their running back ability. <clears throat> Johnny Balls, welcome in. Yeah. What things are happening? What do you what do you mean? You talk about the game or something else? Go down. Jesus. They've got to throw the ball at some point. They can't run the ball and get back in this game, right? So they have to they have to they have to throw the ball. Wait, that's an extra three yards. You should have been down. That mechanic of just um, not going down on contact. Here we go. Go down. Totally screwed up with that. Uh, if I'd have left that linebacker alone in the zone, he might have went after him on alone his own. I came in and walked right into a block. If you have trouble st stopping those uh, out routes by the tight ends, those uh, magenta routes... Not the dark purple, but the lighter pinkish purple ones are the uh, ones that will stop that shit. Up. 
first down. Double tight, guys. Double tight. Four down. Four down. Six, six, Wisconsin formation. These guys are getting their ass kicked and they're running Wisconsin. And they're going to score. <laughs> yeah, break that tackle. And that tackle. Three guys hit them inside the 10, and it's a touchdown. It's exactly the bullshit I'm talking about. Look at this. Nope, breaks that one. Going to break this one here. And he's going to break another one here. <coughs> yeah, I do too, man. Chuck, this game kills me with the broken tackles. The, that is the thing about the game I hate the most. They just um, break entirely too many tackles. And I know they're going to do an onside kick, and I don't do onside kick return, because they're going to kick this right out of bounds. Or right to me. Go down. Thank you. Guys, when you're playing the CPU, I'm going to pause it. When you're playing the CPU, as soon as you recover the onside, hit square and dive to the ground. Because I've turned the ball over on onside kicks because they hit stick me and cause a fumble. So just get to the ground as quick as you can. All right, that should give us 300 yards. Now we can run the rest of the way. <coughs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle with him, man. We're going to run out of time. I don't think we're going to have enough time to get them. Uh, I don't think we're going to have enough time to get them both 100 yards rushing. So we'll just focus on the quarterback because he's the one I want to get 100 yards the most. <clears throat> no, they're not going to let me. He's out of the game, too. Fuck you. <clears throat> Calling timeout so we can get our other running back back on the field. Uh, let's go for let's go the 50 burger guys let's go for it get the 50 burger
There we go. See how fast he is? <laughs> we're out of timeouts now, so even if I get the ball back on a pick or something like that, we're not going to have enough time to get all the rush yards we need. So we've got to do a better job earlier in the game of running the ball. Gonna play cover four here, not worry about it. Thank you, Daniel. Yeah, they're gonna run. All right, let's change our defense. Sit down, and they're calling timeout. They're down 26 points, and they're running the ball and calling timeout. <laughs> the AI on this game cracks me up sometimes. Watch, they're going to go down the field and score. So I'm going to blitz. I'm going to bring some heat. I'm not going to just let him stand back there and pick me apart. We'll see if he can uh, make a quick read. And they run the ball. They call a timeout. <laughs> what? What was the point of doing that? Uh, USN must be on. You can always tell when USN hops on. You see him shove my guy? Did you see the quarterback? And he's hurt. He should be hurt. Where is this animation for us? Specifically this animation. Watch what he does. A forearm shiver. That totally knocks him back to... Two to three yards. Look at this. Off he decleats him and throws him backwards. What button do we push for that? All right, got the win, 50 to 24. I think we're averaging around 50 points a game, so. Since he bowing, hey, thank you for the sub, man. Appreciate that. Welcome in. Shout you out, too. If you guys don't know Cincy Bowen. I don't know what's up with you guys. Guy plays NCAA. Plays MLB. He plays uh, WWE. He's got a great WWE stream. All right, we've got his 300 yards rushing. Came close to uh, 100 yards each. We uh, wasted a lot of time playing defense with them running the ball and chewing up the clock, man. <laughs> All right, one second. Somebody tried to reset my Facebook uh, password. Let me check that out. Hmm. 
All right, let's see if we actually have an upgrade or was that from last stream? Yeah, it was last stream. Hey, let's check out our visits because we know we had visits this week. So let's uh, take a look at what we did. <clears throat> this is week six. Two sacks for the linebacker. We did beat the conference team. I don't think we got the sacks. We did get the 250 passing. Um, we didn't have enough sacks, but that's week seven. Didn't kick the field goal, so we didn't get that 150. Uh, we did do that. Halfback rush for 100 yards. Yeah, not the halfback. It's just rushing for 100 yards total. <clears throat> Did both of those, so that's 550 points plus whatever we, uh, and we got the tight end, got that taken care of. Yeah, we didn't get enough sacks. We should get some commits out of this, though. Let's see how many. I like stacking my commits all in the same week, especially on the offensive side. Those are the easiest ones to get. Now my daughter's bragging. She's, uh, who the hell's calling me? Don't know who that is. Hold on a sec. My sister um, needs some you know. All right. Sorry about that. A little uh, house cleaning with the fam. <clears throat> so we got a thousand points on the visit with the quarterback, but he didn't commit. But we did get the. Uh, yeah, tight end we were looking for, a left tackle and a halfback. And the other tight end. So we're done recruiting tight ends. We got both those guys. Both tight ends. We got one of the two halfbacks. And we got one of the two tackles. Go take a look at this real quick. We got a bunch of points back. <clears throat> So, let's just max him out, get that over with. I'm going to give him 500 points. I don't want to max him out because uh, I need some other guys to, I got to dump some other points on other guys, but we'll, we'll get him so he's at least equal anybody on that board that only has 500 points. All right. So this guy's good to go. We have 2,000 point lead on Auburn and 6,000 on everybody else. He's 99% locked. So... I'm going to dial this back to like 200 points. We might put those, uh, we might bump him to seven. So we'll see. This defensive end, we're gaining ground and we have a visit this week. This kicker, we're number one. So I don't need to worry about his points. All right. This guy we can offer right now. This is one of those defensive ends that we found. He's a Juco, so I won't offer him. We'll just save him. All right. We have a visit with this guy this week, so we'll jump to number one. Let's uh, bump him up to 400. Linebacker, we got a good lead on. Tackle, get him up to 400. This is the other one we need. <coughs> Sorry. Let's offer this guy, see if we can get him. Nope. All right, 
We'll give him 200 for now. This guy is just a uh, backup. Leave those guys alone. And give him 100 because we can... Uh, we can offer him, but I think we have a better guy. Right, this is a 73% lock guy right here. How do I know? Because BYU has a visit, but no offered scholarship. And nobody else has him on the board but us and uh, BYU. So we'll just leave him alone. He's just a backup option anyway. All these guys are backup options. So... Got a good board. This is the tight end we got. 73 speed. What's up, Jimmy? Yeah. CPU cheats, Rocky Tap. Definitely cheats. <laughs> Welcome in, Jimmy. I just got two tight ends. Just got two tight ends to commit to go with these two uh, wide receivers. And uh, what is Vince Campbell? I forgot what he is. This guy's, uh, this guy's the other running back. So we have one running back. We need one more. Leroy. How much you want to bet he's a white dude? Nope, he's not. I was going to say, they mess with the names on these games so much. See a white guy named Dominique. Just cracks me up. They're just they did all of that just to get away from the getting in trouble with the name and likeness stuff. You know what? Let's kick some of these guys up and get these guys off the board. This guy's a JUCO, so we're gonna slide him back down the board. And this tackle I don't necessarily need, so we're going to push him down the board. <clears throat> Let me go through this by position real quick. I know some of you people love this and some of you people hate this. It's boring. Um, so we need one quarterback, and this is the guy we're going. He doesn't even need to be a starter caliber. He just needs to be a body because we already have two great quarterbacks last year. <clears throat> need two running backs. This guy is a backup option. This is the second guy we want. We just offered. He didn't sign. The athlete uh, we already have signed is the number one running back we're looking for. Wide receiver. We only need two. Lionel's going to get cut. Look at this wide receiver, Jimmy. 94 speed, 89 route, 78 catch. 93 speed, 93 route. All right, I got both these tight ends. This guy, 73 speed, but he's got good catch, route running, spec catch, catching traffic, blocking is pretty decent. This guy, slightly faster, slightly worse in catching and, and catching traffic. He's just a body. Um, we do have this uh, tackle that signed. We're looking to get this guy, and uh, he'll go away. We only need two tackles. We added uh, an extra D end to get. So we're looking to get this guy, these two guys. Uh, this one, we're number one on, but he's a Juco. So if I have a choice, I'd rather get one of these two guys that's not a Juco. Make sure of that, yeah. So Nick Butler would be the, the main guy to get out of those. 74 speed, but he's got 87 power, 80 finesse, 80 block shed. My wife and daughter are just killing me with the text messages. Um, outside linebacker, we need two of these guys. This is the main guy we're trying to get. And then uh, we'll take one of these two guys. We'll focus on them in a, in a little bit. We need one middle. So this is the guy I'm hoping for. But this guy could play outside because he's got 81 speed, 93 excel. Uh, he's a 73% lock guy. Corner, we just need one. So Alex Woods is the guy. Jimmy, we just found this guy um, before we started the stream, like two nights ago. I was on here dicking around looking at the low lock guys, and he was just sitting out here. So, uh, yeah. He'll be our number one uh, focus. In fact, I'm going to take these points away from Porter, and we're going to throw them on this def defensive end right here, Nick Butler. 
All right, strong safety, we needed one and we got it. These guys here, I'm looking at as backup options um, to free safety and outside linebacker. Kicker, we just need one. He's got uh, 90 kick power. And then athlete, this guy's a running back and this Jeff Hill, we wanna put at free safety. So that's where we stand on all of that. So let's go look at, uh, whoa, hey, look, we jumped to number one, guys. Who lost? Pitt and USC, we're the only three undefeated teams. Wow, Cal lost to UCLA, that's good. BYU lost to USC. And Ohio State lost in overtime to Illinois. Where's Specta? Specta would be having a cow on that one, man. Illinois law or uh, beat Ohio State. <coughs> All right, so Georgia Tech's on. They're an ACC team too, <coughs> so they should be shooting up the boards here shortly. Fuck Fresno. You guys know how I feel about Fresno. Army, they're not in a prestigious conference either, so. All right, just keep winning. We'll be number one at the end of the year. And we have nobody else in conference undefeated. ACC, Pac-12. We play Mississippi State later in the year. We've we already beat Notre Dame when they were number one. So we're in good shape going forward, guys. Heisman-wise, our quarterback's number two. Our running back fell off the list because he didn't get his 100 yards rushing. Championship contenders, just to tell us what our roster looks like. And we're already number one. So they say we have the 12th best roster for next year, then fifth and first. We'll see how that looks after we uh, finish up this recruiting class. All right. Let me go save this, and then we'll get into the next game. <coughs> Come on. Hey, Jimmy and Cincy, uh, scroll down on my stream and you'll see my about stuff down there below. And I got all the logos fixed. So, uh, you click on a team logo, that'll take you to, uh, that'll take you to the playlist on YouTube. All right. Maryland's 4-0. All right, they got a better offense and the same defense, so this is uh, not going to be an easy game. You know, they're going to be wearing whack, bla whack, black, yeah. Let's see about them red shoes. Okay, we'll make him wear black shoes. And you know which uniform I'm going with. All right, boys. This one is going to be a little bit... Uh, it's going to be a little bit sweaty. They're going to crush me on the ground. I'd rather they passed on me instead of running on me. USN's playing golf. All right. We have a DB and defensive line visiting. Only have two guys. So the linebacker's out for 10 weeks, and their tight end's out for the year. So that left outside linebacker is the guy playing on the side that I rolled to. So that's uh, not good for them. All right, looks like we're going to get the ball first. Yep. Henderson set to return. Yeah. 
It was okay. That broken tackle was good, but uh, we had no momentum to get back up to speed, so they easy, easily took us down here before we forget. Do not like getting hit from the side on the quarterback. Fumbles way more when they hit you from the side, so. I know there was a lane if I had cut it outside, but I also uh, could get uh, hit and fumbled, so try and limit that. Fucking linebacker comes right through the hole. Alright. Oh my god. My wife and daughter are driving me insane. Should be interesting since I haven't thrown a pass yet. <laughs> and dogs, plumber must be here to put the. Uh, the dishwasher in. It's wild. I didn't call this play the entire last game. I usually call this multiple times a game. All right, looking square and X. Looks like we're going to start out this game hot, throwing. <clears throat> yeah, just run right around him. 71 had no clue what he was doing. If he if he tackles that, or tackle, blocks that guy, look at this missed tackle, 71. Yeah, I'm just going to let you go. No attempt whatsoever. <clears throat> Damn it. All right, let's see what their offense is. I hate red zone picks. Nothing outside of broken tackle 900 level for these CPU guys. Nothing makes me more mad than anything else is that that uh pick it. Pick the ball, make a play. <coughs> it's throwing me a pick in the red zone, especially if I'm inside the 10. Hold on, guys. All right, guys. Apparently, uh, Chimney sweep's going to be here, so if you hear a bunch of rattling and stuff, um, that's what it is. Unexpected visitors, so. Mm -hmm. I've got the stop, good. So if you hear a bunch of background noise, that's what it is. You got a chimney sweep. It's not the plumber, it's a chimney sweep. So and the wood burning stove is right over there, so like uh with within ten feet of me. <clears throat> Oh. 
You are on a hot mic, just letting you know. <laughs> just letting you know. Hello. All right. If they will let me run this play or not. Get in there. Get in. Ah, so close. That should have been a touchdown. Tripped over his own guy. All right, new play here. Good start to the game, guys. Good start. So we got uh, got them stopped on their first one. We march right down the field. That long pass play, decent run by the QB. So uh, see what we uh, can do on defense. <clears throat> Uh, coming out with four wide, and you're going to run the ball inside. Sounds like me. <laughs> get him. Won't let me switch to 21. The whole time I'm trying to get the 21 to tackle him from behind. And uh, just wouldn't let me have it. It's called uh, coordinator cam. It's the only camera angle I play on Doggo. Let's you see the entire field in one shot. It's the best camera for uh, passing. You get to see when your outside receivers break open because when you're uh, when you're on the regular camera and you're in tight, anybody on the far wide side of the field, you can't see them at all. And uh, and honestly, it'll help with the. Uh, it helps with running too because you can see the higher angle and see what holes are open to uh, make cut bats and cut backs and set up your blocks. Yeah, I found this one day just messing around and I uh, I uh, no longer play on the tight tight one. <clears throat> oh, missed it. I was trying to go for the pick. At least they scored quick. Give me the ball back. Pardon? Help get on the drill in the back end. Yeah, it's fine. It's just I, I warned him. It's gonna get noisy here, guys. That's fine. Uh, get off me. What do you want to play, coach? All right, we'll do that. Gonna play tight? Nope, playing off. All right, so we have curls on the outside, post in the middle. One of these curls will be open, especially square. Ooh, this might be a touchdown, guys. That was fast, Cincy. That was real fast. 
<laughs> that was a simple, uh, look at that, simple stop route. Whoops, and there was nobody on that side of the field. Look at this. Their defense, everybody on that side of the field. That's why I said one of those, those uh, curls was going to be open. They had nobody. They had one guy on the entire two-thirds left of the field. Look at this. Missed and gone. <laughs> that was fast. So what happens is if they press on the outside like that, you just send them on a streak. And you look for somebody else to throw to, or you uh, run. Yeah, I don't mean hand it off. I mean scramble, get out of there, and take off. When we get the pass yards up in a hurry. All right, let's see. He wanted to dump that off to the uh, tight end right there, didn't he? As soon as we went up there tight, <clears throat> he took off. Let's get back to this. Try and get a little bit of pass rush. Cover. Can't wait to get those two guys we got last year. Those two guys we got last year had 95 speed and really high cover ratings. So once we get them in, get rid of these guys that were uh, default players. Fifteen degrees there, damn. That is cold. It's colder here than it had was been last week, Jimmy. That was done snow. Yeah, don't play the ball. See forty one just stand there and look at it. Vamp the Ripper, welcome in, man. Yeah, we're going to have a uh, shootout today. <clears throat> yeah, that would be funny. That's possible. You never know with this one. Look at that. Circle. They're pressing him. Circle number one. Throw the ball. I hit the button. Throw the ball. Wow, that was fortunate. That should have been picked. That should have been picked. Look at that. We got almost 200 yards passing in the first quarter. <laughs> Third and ten. Now oh, we know what we're gonna play. Might get loud here in a minute, boys.
All right. Circle and square. Circle and the post, square and the end. Hey, thanks for the follow, man. Dre Taplin. Hey, welcome in. Okay. That's fine. All right. You can hear that. I'm not going to talk over it, so we'll just watch. There we go. Good 17 yards. Yeah, I'm going to mute my microphone, guys. Second and ten.
holding offense. Bingo, bingo, bingo. Still second down. down. First and goal. Second and ten. All right, much better. I don't know what was up with the blocking that other play. We don't punt either. <clears throat> yeah, we already got our 250 and still first half. He's got 174 yards and a half.
catch the ball. Alright, I think they're done. <clears throat> Back to our regularly scheduled programming here. Sorry about that. There you go, Cincy. Check this one out. Ah! Come on, get up there. He got stuck, and he's hurt. Almost got there. Fullback love. Where's 49er George? He loves the fullback touchdown runs. <laughs> Pullback with a name Vernon. Look at that. 14 plays, almost four minutes. Did not want to give them the ball back. I think they get the ball to start the half, right? So I didn't want them to uh, have a chance to get a quick score and get the ball to start the second half. All right. So we'll have the uh, dogs barking their head off later when the uh, plumber comes to install the uh, dishwasher that should have been installed yesterday. And then when we get done with the stream today, I'll have to uh, hook up the gas to our new stove and uh, take out the old microwave and put that in with my, they'll do that with my son, so. Pick the ball off. He undercut it to pick it and never made a chance, never made a play on the ball. All right, should be the last play of the half. Last stream, we gave up a touchdown on one of these plays, so we're going to use her back here. That was... Kind of scary again. All right. We got to go back to that Ohio State uh, playbook and find some of those um, quarterback runs because they were stupid good. Hey, watch the ball, watch the ball. 
QB ran for over 200 yards. 19 carries for 200. And my team ran for 300 yards. Cannot get a sack. Like a half second short every damn time. Welcome back in, Macon. This 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 game's not an easy one. There, ninety overall on offense and defense. So. And I fucking dove. Instead of tackling him, I dove. <sighs> don't clip that. But that was that was just horrendous. That's why I don't play defense. I hate playing defense. All you guys in NWO, put your track shoes on, man. I don't care if you score. You gotta stop me. <laughs> That's my attitude. The faster you score, the more time I have with the ball. At least they don't have uh, 200 yards rushing at this point. That's usually the case. How did he catch that? And how did I miss him? <laughs> Good. He should leave San Jose. The roster is just not good enough to uh, let them be competitive. Hold on a second, boys. All right, sorry. So the plumber's going to be here in 30. So it's just going to be Grand Central today at our house. My uh, daughter-in-law and three granddaughters are going to be here. Yeah, don't don't tackle them in the open field. And my son's coming over later. Yeah. So tomorrow's stream will not be interrupted because... Uh, I will do my PT in the morning and then we'll stream after lunch and no one will be here to mess with us. <clears throat> All right, let's see if these guys can block anybody. Come on, Harrison. Up, 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 up. Get through it. Get through it. All right. Midfield. I'll take that. Come on. Give me my... Thank you. Ah, shit. Wrong read. I was looking at the D-tackle instead of the D-end. Square might be open. Nope. X will be. And, of course, nobody blocks. Third and 20. That's exactly where we want to be against a 90 overall team. All right. They want to cheese us. We'll cheese them back. Give me the pass.
X down the middle of the field. Of course that bitch drops the ball. He's wide open and he drops the ball. Inside the 10. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Who is he throwing to? It's this guy right here. Oh my god. Alright. <laughs> what a ragdoll tackle. Look at this. God. Of course he goes forward for seven yards on the tackle. Look at this. Look where he gets hit. That was a five yard flip. <laughs> oh, Golden Puppet, thanks for the follow. Oh my god. That was so ridiculous it has me cry laughing, man. That was a five yard flip. It looked like a Call of Duty ragdoll when you shoot somebody off the top of a building. <laughs> that was stupid. Wow. Hello, Chi. Yeah, I know. My dog's over here. Hey, what are you doing? Hi, Chi. That was ridiculous. Oh, he dropped it. Thank you. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. Well, we'll go with the uh, three-man rush and spy the QB. You know they're going to nail me here. They're going to get a, a stupid out route somewhere. Got him. Thank you. Thank you. About time we got one. We just bum rushed that guy. We're gonna run punt blocking these guys. So this will make up for me having to punt. Pinned him deep, man. That was a nice bounce out at the seven. Oh, well, we got a lot of a lot of room to run here. I'll take that. I will take that. Let's go. Let's go with what coach wants to go with for a while. All right, dive, let's run. Let's work on these rush yards. Yeah, my guy has no wiggle right now. 13 carries, you would think he would be uh, beyond being stuck in the mud. Gonna overload that side. We'll just go here. <clears throat> and of course, he's out of bounds at the one. Thanks for clipping that, Jimmy. He almost has 200 yards receiving. Easy peasy. 
All right, we gotta play some good defense again. We stopped them last drive. Yeah, Jimmy, that's the, ex the exact opposite of me uh, raging last time, right? <laughs> Almost fell out of my chair laughing as opposed to spiking a controller. <laughs> Yeah, I still wanted to say fuck you because he got five yards on the uh, the trip through the air, but uh, get him. <clears throat> yeah, my wife would prefer I laugh more than than uh, rage. So she can always tell what the stream is going to be like when uh, she can hear me yelling. Still can't believe he ragdolled like that. Oh, pick that! I saw him break into the ball, and if I hit circle, he would have missed it for sure. Yeah, definitely need to rage on this game. We only love it because it's the only one in town right now, right? It's still made by EA, so it's still garbage. Oh, look at this little... 13 yard, 14 yard dot, a little floated out route. None of the CPU controlled DBs made a play on it. They just sat there and watched them make the play. Go down. There we go. Uh, if I was running Maryland and they. Had that quarter that quarterback Roderick Valentine. I changed his name to Billy Ray Valentine. You ever seen uh, Eddie Murphy movie? The hell's the name of that one with Dan Aykroyd in it? Jamie Lee Curtis. Trading <sighs> places, yeah. Drawing a blank. I could see the movie. I've seen it multiple times. I just couldn't remember the name of it. Get him. There we go. Ramrod, welcome in. Trying to get physical here with the Terps, man. <clears throat> Spy this running QB one more time. How you doing, man? We're, uh, hey, we surprisingly won the Natty in year one with these guys, so we're trying to uh, double up on them and, uh, Go down. <laughs> Trying to do something I couldn't do at uh, Texas Tech, mostly because we left before we could we do it. We didn't even attempt to do it, but win five in a row. So we'll see. We got to get got to get through with this season before we can think about number three. Yeah, we're not even playing with our studs that we got yet. Oh, catch that! We have two stud corners that are being redshirted right now. And this quarterback is a stud, but we get another one. Um, so it's very much like Texas Tech where both quarterbacks were off the hook. So if one of them gets hurt, we lose nothing. Um, and our offensive line, our uh, incoming offensive line guys haven't, haven't played yet. I think only one of them isn't being redshirted. We got some defensive player at linemen, linebackers, so we'll uh we'll be really good next year. Once all those guys get a year of uh training. I call that cooking, sitting in the oven and cooking. Just killing me with these crossing routes. Yeah, well, once we get done with Iowa, if the uh, Oregon job is open, we're gonna go there immediately. That's my choice. And somebody in, in chat during last season, I can't remember which, which VOD it was, they asked me if I would uh, catch the ball. Asked me if I'd ever go back to uh, Texas Tech, and I said, yeah, I would consider going back to Texas Tech at some point. Problem is, they're doing so well. 
um, in the sim now that they're not going to fire their coach at any point soon. <laughs> Definitely not going back to Central Florida. And uh, we, we would consider going to Mizzou in this one. Oh, that's a pick six he dropped. Come on. I don't need the deflections, guys. I need the picks. Green. Oh, come on with the broken tackles. He's going to get a first. That was some serious EA bullshit right there. That should have been a negative play. And instead they get a first down and almost score. Blitzing the corners off the edge here. The the slot corners are getting blitzed. Fuck the CPU, man. Can't you can't uh, block both those guys. Fuck you, yes. Thought they were going to break that tackle too. Mm -hmm. I really want to throw, but I don't want to give up a safety either. Yep, that was a big one, EJ. All right, this is the pass that went for 80-something yards for a touchdown last time, right? So now they're going to press. Where am I at? 289. See where we're at running wise. Quarterback's close, the halfback's not. He just immediately sheds 74's block, just throws him off like it's nothing. All right, he's over 300 yards passing. Last time we ran this play, I think we got like 19 yards. I'll take 31. <laughs>
What does that give me? All right, he's got his 100, so 40 more yards from the fullback. We can do that. All right, not the fullback, but the halfback. Um, not sure because I've only ever been to uh, Notre Dame and Mizzou for college football. I went to two games at Notre Dame back-to-back -back years. Saw him play USC, and I saw him play Pitt with Larry Fitzgerald. Um, and Mizzou I didn't go to until uh, my daughter went to school there. We went parents' weekend, which seems really strange, do not Mizzou fan, I've never gone to a Mizzou game. Offense did not block for shit on that play. All right, Coach... Kinnick, Kinnick. <laughs> X and R1. There we go. They want to cover a receiver. I'll just send him on a streak and throw it to him right away. All right, we got our two score lead. 94 yard drive. Gotta love that. What's up, Specta? Hey, in the last week that we played, um, Illinois knocked off number one Ohio State in overtime. <clears throat> so we jumped from three to one. Go down. It takes four guys to tackle somebody. And Jimmy, send me some lunch too, man. Wife and I ordered pizza from this uh, divey looking Italian restaurant that we went to when we dated. And uh, so good. We crushed that pizza and I could have eaten a half of another one. Got it! There we go. First time we caught one all day instead of knocking them all down. Yeah, that guy stayed home. I was hoping he would crash down and I would go uh, read option and go to the left. But uh, he didn't want to give me that play. Here you go, Cincy. Come on, baby. Yeah. Let's see what you got. Check 59, Mike. Ready? Mike is 59. Mike. Ha. The 39 jumped right in my pitch lane. Like right here. I wanted to pitch right there, but that would have been a fumble. So I just uh I took the took the shot and just let it go. Yeah, the the Defensive end didn't blow it up. It was the DB. All right, circle and square. And nobody's open. I'm not punting. He has over 200 yards receiving for sure, that guy. All right, if we get the ball back, I'll just run that running back and get him his, uh, get him his 100 yards, but not sure we'll get the ball back. We'll see. If we do, we might not have a lot of time left, so it won't won't help us, but 
I expect that we play Illinois next. So, and they just they just knocked off uh, Ohio State for us. So, <laughs> and we got a uh, we got both tight ends to commit. We got a tackle to commit, and I think we got a an athlete that was the running back we were chasing. I can't remember if he committed or or not. I think he did. So. We're in good shape on the commit wise. Oh yes! Turn, go, 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 go. I'll take that. Pick six, pimps, pick six, right? <laughs> First time I said that, man, revamp laughed his ass off. All right. Well, we still have two minutes. We might get another score. And if they come out and just run the ball, we're just going to call a timeout and give us enough time to get our uh, running back his yards because computer has no feelings, right, guys? No feelings. You know, run it up on them. Do it to a user and you might get yelled at. See how fastly they get that. Exactly. Let's see what they do here. Hey, Spectre, I said earlier, I sent you a, a Discord thing. I got a 30 day kick from uh, Madden Reddit. Almost got another one for that combo I sent you. <laughs> uh, whatever, whatever, don't care. I just chuckle. Let's go secondary step up. We got a screen pass. I thought he was going to break both of those guys tackling him. Stumble, get it onto his feet, and, and get a first down. Let's run punt block on these guys. Oh, well, fair catch because I don't want to waste time and I want to give myself plenty of room to run the ball. Let's get this running back his yards. All right, where's he at? 21 yards. about four more runs not yet Spectre not yet you saw the guys we got last year right so you'd rather have somebody from that group <clears throat> already got a uh, year of uh, cooking in the oven as a red shirt and then they can come out and play right away and they'll have uh They'll be they'll be in the mid eighties right off the rip. All right, five more yards. We've only thrown the ball nineteen times. We have like th way over three hundred yards. All right, he got his hundred yards. Yeah, but you got to get some. You got to have enough points for that bad boy. Down to the one again. <laughs> He's got 264 yards in receptions, Jimmy. Broke the Iowa record.
Got the touchdown. Yay. All right, Cincy. You want double X? In black, right? Jimmy, you got to redeem your points, man. Yeah. What color? All right. Eight seconds left. And so far, the only white one was uh, FG said he wanted white. <laughs> so here's what's going to happen after all you uh, fresh pimps get yours. It's kind of hot. It came blasting through my uh, speakers on my computer, though, so. <laughs> I need to check to see if that's the full version or the uh, half, because I made one that was only 30 seconds long, so it wouldn't take forever. So, yeah. Once we get through this initial run of, uh, of the pimps getting their shirts, it's going to go to 75 or 100,000 to get a shirt, because I'm not dumping 100 bucks out of my pocket for everybody. <laughs> It's going to be like $10 a shirt. I'm taking money I've gotten through uh, subs and I'm pouring it back into uh, giving you guys something to spend to spend your stuff on. All right. So we both got 100 He had 264 yards in receptions. One pancake. <laughs> we ran for 200 yards and we got one pancake. <laughs> And we threw for almost 400 yards, but only one pancake. 63-28. I'm gonna have to. Uh, I'm gonna have to check these defensive sliders again. It's uh, getting to be a little bit ridiculous. Oh, oh, hey, Spectre! I said earlier you weren't in here. Um, I've come up with two new stream ideas. One of them is uh, this game right here. And let me check this real quick. Um, the other one is I have realigned the entire NCAA into uh, 12 team conferences. Two of them are 14 teams. And it's all done by region. So the uh, Big 12 is nothing but Texas teams. Um, yeah, we're not bumping that up. All right. We're, we're uh, using J-Kits sliders from Operation Sports. So we're going to bump that up just a little bit. Anyway. Um, so I realigned the entire NCAA into new new uh, conferences, and they're all done geographically. And that one would be no gameplay except for bowl games. Um, I would just sim, and I would do the fast sim, not like Northern Colorado where I, we watched the games. We would just advance the week, advance the week, advance the week, kind of like what we did with uh, Louisiana Monroe. And I would just recruit. So we can get through seasons faster and I'll just recruit, recruit, recruit. So anybody who wants to watch just recruiting. Um, yeah, here, I'll show you what it is. Give me a second. Got to find it.
All right, give me a second while I uh, blow this up so you can actually see it. There we go. All right, so Pac-12, North, Washington, Washington State, Oregon, Oregon State, Cal, and Hawaii. South, these are the south half. We threw in San Jose and Fresno and San Diego State. There's the Big 12, West, East, SEC North, SEC South, Conference USA West, and East, Sunbelt North, and South. <clears throat> Here's the Mac West and the Mac East. Look at this. This is all Ohio. The only thing they're missing is Kent State. Mountain West, uh, North, and South. Um, American, North, and South. ACC, North, and South. There's the Big Ten, West, and East. And then the Indies are Notre Dame and BYU. And I haven't picked a team, so I kind of like let you guys pick um who i go to and we'll just re we'll just recruit the shit out of every it's all it's just gonna be nothing but recruiting and simming <clears throat> that way people want to see recruiting that's all you want to see welcome in we'll get a shit ton of it yeah i don't know at that point i don't care because i'm just straight simming <clears throat> Um, actually I'm removing a bunch of indies cause there's usually like five or six, right? And we're down to just two. And that would put BYU and, uh, Notre Dame in different conferences. Um, but, uh, the game won't, uh, let me have zero independent teams. Let's advance. We, uh. Pushed our sliders up a little bit for the CPU, so we'll we'll inch those up a little bit at a time. If we keep putting up 56 and 60 points, we'll just creep them back up. <coughs> All right, Jimmy, hustle back, man. Hurry back. We got one more game, and then we're done. I got to do some uh, stuff in the kitchen. We got to take down an old microwave and put in the new one, and then hook up the gas to the new stove. We had uh, all of our appliances were white. We redid the kitchen and now they're all stainless. So we had three of them get delivered yesterday. And earlier in the stream, we had a, a chimney sweep come. So I had to mute my mic for a while because he was uh, running the, the brush up the, up the stack, so. If any of you guys have fireplaces, I would recommend uh, getting as much firewood, seasoned firewood as possible because your uh, energy bills, once it gets cold this winter, the price of, uh, my wife works for a natural gas company, so the price of this shit's going to go through the roof and uh, it's mostly because they're limiting the uh, pipelines, so that limits your supply. <laughs> so you saw what happened in Texas last year, so if you... Uh, if you uh, can stack up, I would. <laughs> Did I tell him to follow the uh, guy? No. I mean, when he came in, I told him right away, you're on a hot mic. All right, we got the quarterback. We got the defensive end, and we got the – they say he's – Jeff Hill is a, a corner, but we're going to move him to free safety. So quarterback's done. One of three defensive end is done, and the free safety is done. Let's go check this out real quick. And we got a plumber here now taking care of the dishwasher. So crazy. Come on, open. All right, so let's go move these guys around first. Make sure we got them in numerical order. Darius Gray, poor guy. He's going to be a third string quarterback his entire career. And this is a 
Free safety. This is going to be the next running back. Vince Campbell, 93 speed, 83 elusive, 72 carry, 90 agility, 87 excel, 91 stamina. And he can throw the ball. If we want to do a halfback option, he's got 81 throw power. <coughs> we did get the strong safety, though, didn't we? I didn't mark him off the list. <laughs> All right. So we need a halfback, a tackle, two DNs, two outsides, a middle, a corner, and a kicker. So let's go see. Have any visits? Yeah, let's get these visits scheduled before I space them out. This guy's a backup op option, so we're we're just gonna put him for the bye week in week fifteen because I don't need him. Um, we do need so we'll throw him on Illinois. All right, so top schools, outside linebacker, defensive end. Kicker. Corner. I found this guy over the weekend and threw him on the board. Um, and we've done that in basically two weeks. I offered and gave him a thousand, basically a thousand points each week. <laughs> so guys, don't forget to check Lolak every single week. All right. So they had a visit and jumped ahead of us, but it's fucking New Mexico. So I'm not too worried about it. Push him up. Push him up. This guy's a Juco. All right, we're not getting Nick Butler. LSU decided to jump in on him. So we'll try Harrison. Oops, too far. We'll say that Juco is a last ditch. This guy, I'm not too worried about him. And I don't need him. I do need him. And he is a 73 percenter. Look at outside linebackers. I think I need to offer this guy. Yeah, I do. All right, let's offer and see if we get him, and then we'll just cut Lance. He's a Juco. Didn't get him. That's fine. I'm not going to give any points because he's Juco. All right, corner. We don't need him. Halfback, I'll push him up because he's actually on the list. I'll push him up as well. Don't need him. These guys are just backup options at outside linebacker. He's a backup option at offensive line. So, actually, let me go back. So I have everybody at 700. <laughs> And tell you what, we'll throw the extra points on Meeks just to make sure uh, people don't creep up on us. So look at top classes. We're number one. We have four five stars, four four stars, and three three stars. Not a bad start, guys. Not a bad start. There you go, Cincy. They're only a two-star school, but they're uh, up the board. This is what I was talking about with Texas Tech earlier. Someone asked me in a previous stream if I would think about going back to Texas Tech because it's the same head coach that won four natties in a row there. And I said, yeah, but... They're five star. They're not going to be firing their coach at any point. We gave these guys one recruiting class. I don't see Ohio State. All right. Let's go look at the top 25 and see what happened behind us. So USC jumped up. We play Mississippi State our next to last game of the regular season. We already beat Notre Dame the first game of the year. Look at Fresno, Georgia Tech. There's Ohio State. We gave them two classes. They're burning those off. Pitt lost. Pitt lost to Louisiana. No, that's Louisville. UL's Louisville. Florida lost to Vandy. Holy shit. Go look at our, our stats real quick and we'll get into this last game. All right, so our QB has 1,500 yards passing and that's in five games. So he's averaging 300 yards a game. And our running backs got 518 yards in five games. Quarterback's there as well. 
Uh, our receiver, Washington, just set a school record. So now he's number two in the nation in receiving yards. Let's go look at these season stats real quick. So the QB, 16 touchdowns, seven picks, only seven sacks, 300 yards passing. So that's about normal. Rushing, you can see both these guys are going to get 1,000 yards. You only need to average like 79 yards or something like that a game for 1,000. So they're both going to get 1,000 rushing. He's definitely going to get 1,000 receiving. These guys will need some work. No pancakes. It's ridiculous. Good TFL number. Surprisingly good sack numbers. Ton of picks. Remember we had four the first game of the year. So, all right, let me save this one more time. <clears throat> Since I updated my recruiting board, let me save this just in case the uh, game locks up in the middle of playing the game. <clears throat> <coughs> and then we'll get into this Illinois game and we'll call it a day. Be short and sweet. Um, I will be back tomorrow after I have physical therapy at 1030. So I'll be back home by noon. And I'll grab some lunch and then we'll hop on. So roughly 1230 Central Time tomorrow. And we will play Northwestern, Wisconsin, and Minnesota. Three pretty good teams. Northwestern and Wisconsin were ranked when we started the stream today. Um, Friday and Saturday I will not stream. Pretty good chance I'll stream Sunday night. Um, and uh, that will be Purdue, Mississippi State, and Nebraska. And then next week, um, I'll be back to PT on Mondays and Wednesdays. So next week, it'll either be uh, Monday afternoon or Tuesday morning. We will play, hopefully, Big Ten Championship, either a Big Bowl game or a BCS Championship game, and then the entire offseason. So we'll be done with this whole season in a week. So... I love these guys and their uh, blues. But we're going to go all white. I really like that all white helmet. But we're going to go all white. And we're going to go with the normal um, Iowa uniform. <clears throat> so... I didn't even pay attention to what their uh, overall was. I know they're 3-3, three and three, but they just beat Ohio State in the sim. <clears throat> so, I know Jimmy's running around since he... I already got a... Uh, screenshot from my sister on the shirt so that boom is going to cover like this much on the front of the shirt hindsight thank you for the biddies man welcome in man welcome in appreciate that you should uh check your channel redemption look at you <laughs> look on the von father down there you should probably have enough points I know you have enough points. All right, so their wide receiver is questionable. Their tight end's probable. So. Oh. Hey, man, you going to be streaming here in a little bit? Because uh, this is our last game. So if you're uh, you're going to be hopping on, um, we'll uh, send everybody your way. We can watch you play some uh, pretty good Call of Duty. Nice kick. Wow. There's no wind, so their kicker's really good. It's good to know early. Got 
Thank you for the sub again, too. Appreciate that. Trying to win back-to-back -back in the first two years at Iowa, man. We're uh, almost halfway through. <laughs> Here. Know what you can do. Is that it? No, it's Obi Van. Type in Obi Van with a V, not a W. Get off me! Like this one. God damn it. He, uh, he's fast, but he's not as agile, man. And we don't punt unless we absolutely have to, so. <laughs> All right. Who's going to get open? God damn it. Fucking defensive end wouldn't let me, uh, look at this defensive end. I want to see the speed of this defensive end because I'm literally 90 speed quarterback left end on Illinois. Why does it do that? Why does it default to the main position? Go left end. All right, 75 speed. That dude tracked me down 75 speed, and I'm 91 speed. Yeah, that's bullshit. Here's your trap game, boys. Here's the trap game. They're trying to beat the number one team two weeks in a row. Here, Grim. You missed this. You got to see this play. Let me find Jimmy clipped it. This is hilarious. And, of course, he uh, went forward for five yards to get the first down. And Michigan wins. All right. I'm going to focus and uh, not chat so much. I want to uh, force the shit out of these guys who have an easy fourth quarter. So we're just going to do what we do. Yeah, please press. Thank you. Dude, just torch these guys for... 300 yards. <clears throat> Did you like that throw, Cincy? <laughs> Don't press a fast receiver on that route, man. There we go. Toe tapping. Good job, Abrams. I think he's graduating. I think he's graduating. Yes. Boom. Touchdown. Jack Washington.
He's out there dancing. Look at him. If they press that dude, we can get 200 yards receiving every fucking week. That's just an easy, let him break the press and lob it over their head, and he's fast enough to go chase it down. Doesn't look like there's going to be any kick returns today. Both of us are kicking it out of the end zone. All right, let's go. We're going to try and run blitz these guys. And we'll uh, press the uh, corners. Truth, welcome in, welcome in. We are... Uh, Trying to win our sixth straight game to start the uh, season. We uh, we got to number one um, last after last week's win. After Illinois, who we're playing here right now, knocked off number one Ohio State. So they did us a favor. Now they're trying to do it to us. God damn, go down. So we. Uh, We'll be halfway through the season after this game. So. Next season's looking to be pretty dominant. We'll schedule. We only get two non-conference games because of being in the Big Ten. Um, and we're already playing number five Mississippi State later this year. We played number one Notre Dame. So. It's not like we're playing uh, garbage non-conference games. It's just some of the teams in our in our conference are. Uh... Oh come on! What is that? Um. Yeah, these they they do. Once there we go. Once Ohio State's coach gradu or graduates, retires, and Michigan's once you get rid of the upper level coaches, then those big schools get lesser head coaches, and they don't recruit with a shit. They don't get the uh, the extra. They don't get the extra recruiting bonuses. Got a defensive end covering this guy. That's not good. <clears throat> yeah, I knew he was going out there. And of course, he just totally whiffs on the tackle. Do you see him? He's running with his arms out like this. Who the fuck tries to tackle with their arms out like that? All right, they want to run the ball. We'll bring in our run defense. And then they throw it, of course. And he, oh, he actually took him down to one. Yep, this is definitely going to be a sweaty, sweaty ass. Uh, Cheesy EA trap game. Tom Powers. What a name. Be better if it was Tommy. Tommy Powers. All right. What does this do? This kind of guy. He didn't get in. My spy guy was way over in the corner of the end zone. What the hell is he doing in the corner of the end zone? There's not anybody on that half of the field and the spy guy standing in the corner talking to the cheerleader. Fuck you. Ha 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 ha.
There we go. Goal line stand. <clears throat> That's where they lost the game right there, guys. Looking square all day. I'm sorry, X, not square. He was doing the square in. That was wrong words. All right, let's see if we can get this quarterback going on the ground. All right, go hit this DB. Don't let him come in and get me. Of course. Nope. He just runs right around him. Coach, what do you want? No, I don't like that. We'll take that, though. All right, this is either going to be the short little out to the tight end, or a deep shot to circle, or a scramble. Hundred fifty yards in the first quarter. See how fast that guy got off the block and got in there on me? Thank God he's ninety one speed. Starting to remind me of Mahomes right here, man. And run. Running will get better next year when he gets better um, carry and um, break tackle and stuff. Yeah, I love how they lower their head and just battering ram right through the dude's chest, too. I just stood there. Hey! Is this heaven? No. It's Iowa. Nobody in the middle of the field. Nobody. They just let him go right between those two zones. Deep zone guys, too deep. Shallow zone guys, too shallow. Oh, wow, we actually batted down a pass. Don't see that too often. They usually do it to me instead. <coughs> oh, man. Here comes a run. And nobody's out there to tackle him. All right. Big stop here. Make him kick a field goal. Nice. Had my guys turn around backwards and then it hits the guy underneath. DB on that side is back to the play. All right. We'll just call a blitz. 
I'll let the computer play this one. I'm going to grab something to snack on. Didn't set it up right. It's in a hurry. It's all right. This crap like here is just an unnecessary delay in the game. I know it's for presentation purposes, but it really serves no purpose. He wasn't even close to being out of bounds. So now we're sitting here waiting for this game to get to a point where I can actually. Mom. All right, please crash down. Thank you. Thank you. Damn dive tackle. He's gone that time, Spectre. Need another stop. Need another stop. Oh. 
Oh, and that uh, pause before was my wife coming to tell me that the uh, plumber came and uh, can't install that dishwasher here. So we have to go return the dishwasher and get another one. Yay. Just when you think everything's taken care of. <laughs> Can this day get more complicated? All I want to do is stream. Forget. Oh, he caught it and held on. Oh, my God. I thought for sure that was going to be a pick. Watch him break on this ball. Wow, he got mossed. <clears throat> Uh, so who have we had come today? We've had the chimney sweep come, and we thought it was next week and not today. We had the plumber come today when we thought he was supposed to be coming yesterday, and now he can't even do his job, so we got to reschedule that. So that even means even longer time with no dishwasher. <laughs> and uh, come on. Still got to put in the microwave and the stove later today. Got my... Daughter-in-law and three granddaughters coming over later today. Oh, and our dog got fixed um, yesterday. Or the younger, the puppy. She's one year old. So, yeah, it's been a hell of a week. Come on! Should have been no gain. Oh, we still have a microwave that works. We just don't have the stove cooked up. I don't know that they're. I don't know if they're coming by for food. They're just coming by. Thank you. Come on, Henderson, catch the ball. Fuck. Right in his hands. No reason to drop that pass. They're playing three three five, stack that middle. There was no way we were gonna run the ball there. Cut that back too quick. Didn't give it enough time to uh, go to the left, cut back and ran right into a tackle. There we go. He is lacking in the rushing yards in the first half. I wasn't sure that guy was going to get that last block at all. <laughs> was not sure I was going to get to the edge. Welcome back, Daniel. <clears throat> it's going to be a little bit of a boring drive because we're just pounding the ground trying to... Uh, Get these rush yards done a little bit sooner. We know we can throw on these guys. Ready. Black 
All right, get the 100 yards out of the way. Shit, I wanted to hit X and hand it off, and I missed it. I was hitting X, and he didn't do it. And face mask, wow. Wow. I'll take that. I'm actually seeing penalties in this game. All right, looking at the tight end and the out and the uh, fullback on the Texas route here. Boom. Fullback love just for you, George. I know you're working, probably not in here, but uh, gotta get the uh, tight ends or the uh, fullback some touchdowns for you since that's your favorite. <clears throat> See if we can hold these guys. I think they get the ball to start the half. Yep. I had, a, I had a pass where I rolled out and threw it way back over the middle. It's the same route, but it was a really long developing route for him. Get him, get him, get him. Come on. I love that shove to his face. Just pushes that guy, that, that the DB or linebacker, whoever that is. Just hammers him right in the face. Oh, Jesus. Wrong, wrong coverage there. God damn. Nothing little about Lee. Fuck. Well, at least I'll get a shot with 40 seconds. You know, we can do that. Believable. I hate defense. Have I said that before? I hate defense. In this game, specifically, I hate defense. I think I hate defense. What do you guys think? All right, that's fine. Yeah, your Illinois is not going to win this game. Not a fucking chance. This is either going to be a long pass or a long run. Probably a long pass because they're going to press. Or not. <clears throat> He's got 91 yards and a half. God damn it. I meant to tap. I meant to tap it and I hit. I just mashed the button and threw a line drive. I wanted to float that.
Got to block. Guys have to block. Can't do this. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's not. I'm hitting X to get it to switch, and it switched right to the play. It's not the play I wanted to run. I had to burn two timeouts because of that. Thanks, game. Don't do me any favors. R1 might be open deep. X is. And it's incomplete. Yeah, we're going for it. I don't give shit. Circle square. Circle's a first down. Square's a uh, a zone beater. <laughs> Catch the fucking ball! You guys know what's coming. Oh, you bitch. <laughs> I should have done the step back move instead and try to cut him. If I, if I do the step back, he might get in. And I tried to cut under him and he grabbed me. Isn't it, isn't it funny how they can uh, just just open field, arm tackle like that, no big deal, but we hit them four times in the backfield and they don't go down. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that crazy? That should have been a touchdown. Funny how he was covering both of those guys running deep on that play, though. One corner is going to cover two guys doing a fly route. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's because of the game specter. I should have done step back instead of trying to cut around him. What the hell was that? Hey, Spec, did you see this play earlier? There we go. <laughs> Notice that he uh, flops forward for five yards, too, to get the first down. Yeah, that's supposed to like offset my rage, my rage clip from uh, last week or whatever when I was spiked my controller. How are they lined up? All right, we should be able to run this play. Yeah, just got enough for the first down. That's fine.
Oh, their pursuit is off the hook, isn't it? They're just 100 miles an hour across the field every time. Give the fullback a few carries. Yeah, that pitch was not going to work. That's too bad. That's too bad. I'll take that. Give me that first down. Russ is a senior. He's not my favorite player, so I'm not too worried about beating him. <clears throat> there we go. Just for you, Jimmy, to the tight end for the touchdown. All right, I see since he's streaming in NCA as well. So what we're going to do after this game, oh, jeez. What we're going to do after this game is uh, we're going to raid Cincy. Should have been a sack. Then he makes the throw while he's throwing off my defensive lineman, throws a dot, and he breaks a tackle, and it's in for a touchdown. Fuck you, EA. Fuck you. You trash fucking programmers can kiss my ass. Third-rate sports gaming company. Go fuck yourselves. No, that's what EA stands for, right? Everything's ass. The fuck is 71 doing? He's blocking. He's air blocking. We're going to run pretty much this entire drive because I want to get both these guys that are 100 yards rushing 
so that when we get to the fourth quarter, I can just throw this shit out of the ball, and uh, we'll just burn these guys deep, and I don't care, get 500 yards passing on the game. Fuck these assholes. <clears throat> God, get out of my way. Kiss my ass. I had to say that in the same uh, cadence that their EA Sports. Yeah, Virginia Tech's got New York Yankees logo on the side of their helmet. I showed it on Twitter. Fucking tackle! It's a run. That's what your zone. That purple zone is specifically for that play. Mm. That'll be good. I'll watch that game. Quack, quack. Go, Ducks.
Should have been a sack. I don't know why they don't try to sack him on their own. The guy's standing right next to him, and he won't make an effort to make the sack. I got to take control of the guy to try and make a sack, and then he breaks it. He just shrugs it off. I don't. I don't understand. Now they go for it. Watch. They're going to go for it. They won't kick it. They'll go for it. I knew he had the leg. It wasn't a question whether he would make the kick or not. <laughs> Indiana kicking the shit out of Wisconsin. All right, eight point game. All right, let's look statistically where we're at. We have the pass yards easily. We're at 298. And Maxwell breaking off that 44 yard run took care of his rush yards. So we just need 17 for Williamson. All right. We take care of his stats and then we just finish the game, basically. My awareness of my offensive line is just horrible. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not doing the 0-100. I value my controllers. I don't know how Perrin plays on those. I mean, I know he's a good player and he... But... I, I couldn't mentally, I couldn't deal with the uh, bullshit the game gives you in addition to that. <laughs> and if I did play them, I certainly wouldn't play them on stream. What does he need? He's got his 100 yards. All right. Sounds like my granddaughters are here. X is going to be open. Just by the way the defense lines up, I know who to throw to. I wish they'd get that first down shit off the screen so I can see my blocks. Alright. Nope, we're not going verts. Just run those DBs off and you have the entire sideline. You just got to beat one defensive end and gone. All right. It's the first game all year we've given up more than 28 points. 
Yeah, he did. He's got the speed. He doesn't have the agility that Mahomes did. The wiggle isn't quite there. I could I could move with Mahomes any direction I wanted to and and uh juke guys right and left. This guy's a little stiffer. But his his speed is equal. <laughs> Hit him in the ankles and flipped him. Watch this tackle. Watch 28. Boom. He does a cartwheel, lands on his head. He cut me, little bitch. Oh, he fumbled it. There we go. Strip sack, fumble, recovery. That was a bit risky. They shed those blocks so fast. Yeah, that was a halfback too. That wasn't a wide receiver. Uh-oh. Got 167 yards rushing, three touchdowns. All right, 340 left in this game. There's no way they're getting 21 points on us. So we should be 6-0 and at the second half of the uh, season to go. So tomorrow afternoon, um, 12.30, 1 o'clock Central Time, we'll have Northwestern, Wisconsin, and Minnesota. And then uh, probably Sunday night, we'll have Purdue, Mississippi State, and Nebraska. And then next week, either Monday or Tuesday, either Monday afternoon or Tuesday morning, we will have uh, Big Ten Championship or Bowl Game, whatever it happens to be, whether it's BCS or not. And uh, down. And uh, the entire off season. So by this time next week, we should be done with uh, Season 2. Yeah, nobody's out there. Sorry. At least EA Cheese waited for the last game of the stream and didn't start me out in a bad mood. <laughs> Streams are not fun when I'm raging in the first game of the day and I get two more to play. <sighs> Took. I was trying to hit circle to go to the defensive lineman to come in and get him. And when I hit it, it went to that linebacker covering that guy and it stopped him dead in his tracks so he couldn't try to pick the ball off himself. Game mechanics. Yeah, I hit him when he goes down.
Dude, oh, Jesus. No one's out there covering. Come on, guys. We're trying to get a pass rush here, and you're just standing around letting him walk out there in the middle of nowhere all by himself. I know they're doing on site. Man, Jimmy, we're getting garbage time touchdowns too because I'm I'm airing it out. Don't need to run the ball anymore. Tight end. X and triangle. Oh. I haven't called that play all day. And you know exactly how to play on defense. Isn't that amazing? Here's a pro tip. Throw your toss plays to the short side of the field because your offensive line doesn't have as far to run. Yeah, go ahead and call that timeout. That's okay. I'll take my field goal. I think we had a kicker visiting anyway, right? So I need this field goal. <clears throat> Back up to three scores. Yeah, maybe I didn't have the kicker this week. But it's always a good idea to kick a one over 40 yards if you're way up late in the game. You get that kicker coming in for a visit. Just uh, meet those goals. There's going to be another garbage time touchdown right here, Jimmy. He's going to break. And uh, he's going to break and he's going to hit somebody. And he's going to, yeah, look at this. Yeah, 25 yards. He's going to pass for over 400 yards. If I throw a zone, I'm gonna throw cover four. They'll just they'll just nail me underneath. They'll get it un underneath one of these cover those those low right in between the zones. I knew that was coming. Oh, and he holds on to it. Wow. Our guy gets hit right on the uh, catch, and he drops it, but they, they hold on to it. Got to love it, man.
Uh, and it's always just enough for a first down, so the clock stops. That's me slowing them down. <laughs> Simply amazing. There you go. That's normal. Free kick out of bounds. Kicking team. Still first down. Yeah, we're putting up another touchdown right here. I don't know how he caught that ball. And we're going for two. I get the ball back, we're going to go for another one. Fuck these guys. We get a pick here, we're going deep again. All right, 32 seconds, plenty of time with two timeouts. No one fuck with me, let's go. Got 181 yards rushing.
That's me being salty. Twenty-two seconds. All right, 74 to 49. What a shit show that was on defense. All right. Let's see what the uh, damage was. We ran for 300 and threw for 400, so... All right, 20 of 26, 405, five touchdowns, no picks, one sack. 20 carries for 196 and four touchdowns, three 20 yard runs. Williamson had his 116. Three catches for 120, three catches for 90. Okay. We had a decent amount of TFLs. We had four sacks, three picks. It's kind of hard to overcome some of the uh, throws that they get away with. So, yeah, Joker, I don't like to play defense because it's broken in this game. They just, I had a play earlier with a guy, I had him sacked, and he, he breaks out of the sack, throws it off his back foot while he's falling backwards, and throws a dot, and then that guy breaks the, uh, Breaks the tackle and just walks into the end zone. So, and these are on slightly modified J kit sliders. So, we pushed them up a little bit on defense and their offensive blocking and stuff. So, anyway. All right, it's two o'clock. We're going to we're advancing this week. I want to see what happens with the recruits, and then we'll uh, head out of here. We're going to go raid Cincy Bowen Gaming because he uh, is one of my buddies, and he's playing NCAA as well. So you guys can go have fun with watching Cincy play, and uh, I'll go deal with all the other stuff I got to deal with around the house today. So. Um, but I will be back tomorrow. And 12.30, 1 o'clock Central Time, probably closer to 12.30. Um, yeah, this isn't even default Heisman. This was Jay Kitts. Yeah, default Heisman was pissing me off because they were breaking every fucking tackle. Man, I mean, it's bad enough as it is, but... I, I was playing on... Uh, Default Heisman for a while because I'm in a league, the NWO league, and uh, we play on default Heisman. All right, so we got three more visits. This linebacker wasn't overly impressed, and that's okay. We're not going to get all of these guys here. Once I get all of my positions filled, we're going to cut everybody else off the board. All right, so this outside linebacker, good. Defensive end, good. We'll be ready for a visit. We can schedule that. Corner, he's ready for a visit. See if we can get him to say yes right now. Nope, that's okay. Um, the linebacker, looks like he had three guys use lock picks. <laughs> Well, one was a visit. I, I take that back. One was a visit, but Minnesota and Ole Miss use lock picks. So this guy's going to the offseason. 
But if we can get everybody um, locked up, all right, this guy's a 73 percenter. So in two weeks, we'll be number one. And I won't offer until we get there. Although we might be able to, if we have a visit for him, then I'll go ahead and offer him now. <clears throat> See if he wants to come play. He's the Juco. Oh, all right, that's fine. This guy's, these are all just backup options here. I'm not too worried about all of this. This is all the good stuff we have so far. So, need a few more in the 70s. All right, three visits. Let's get those out of the way. All right, Minnesota. Minnesota. And Minnesota. Good. So, we have three guys visiting. And where are we at? We should still be number one. Yeah. Four, four, and three. Anybody else in the top 25 do anything? Georgia Tech jumped up. So Georgia Tech, USC, Fresno. Two votes for Fresno. Get the fuck out of here. Arkansas lost to Bama. All right. I'm going to check these stats real quick. He's almost first in pass yards. So, he's just shy of 2,000 in six games. So, 329 per game. Rushing, they both have over 600. Both have 11 touchdowns. Both averaging over 100 yards a game. He needs 170, I'm sorry, 275. Yeah, 275. That'll get done next stream. So we got to work on these guys. Abrams and Henderson, got to get them on a better path here. Got a few more pancakes, but not a ton. TFL's looking nice. Could use a few more down in these guys' range. Sacks are spread out. Could use a lot of those. Picks are all over the place. We're getting a lot of picks, so that's good. So. All right, let me save this, and then we will head on out to uh, Cincy. So I'm going to get that ready to go. So, we will start that, and when you guys ready, we'll head on over there. So, uh, thank you guys for hanging out with me today. We will be back tomorrow and uh, play three more games with Northwestern, Wisconsin, and Minnesota. So, those should be uh, tougher games. So, hopefully, we have some, some good, good gameplay for you. Finish up some of these other recruits. So... Anyway, thanks guys. I will uh, be back tomorrow and I'll see you then.